Hi, this is Willie. Thanks again for watching another one of my beginner videos. Several months ago, I created a video on The Apprentice, and in that video, I showed you how to make a carrying cradle. Well, one of the items that I've been getting a lot of questions about are the two pieces that are left over. How do you use those to find the center of gravity? Well, I want to take the time in this video to show you how to do it. So let's just dive into the video, and this is how you use those two parts. Okay, here are the measurements for the two pieces. They are 10 inches long, two and a half inches wide. You'll also need to mark a slot that's one inch wide and six inches long and cut that piece out. Okay, once you've done this, you want to round the edges off so that it won't damage the bottom of the airplane. I've also placed another mark that's on the outside so I know exactly how high to place it on the cradle. Once you've done that, you want to apply this to the front of the cradle and then you can take the clips that are provided and attach it so that it won't slip off. Now you're set to put your airplane on and find its center of gravity. One point that I do want to mention is that you'll have to canter the uh, two pieces a little bit to fit the dihedral angle of the airplane. So make sure you uh, take a look at these shots so you can see what I'm talking about. Finally, you can also use the cradle uh, center of gravity pieces to not only find that for the uh, apprentice, but it's just as good to use for any other type of airplane. So here's a look at my Habu, which is a small airplane, and you can see that if it can fit between the two pieces, you can also balance a different aircraft. Okay, I think that's all I need to share on this particular video, and I do want to thank you for watching my channel. Please subscribe if you get a chance.